The, the thing, you know, some, sometimes um, people, you know, I had some experiences here in Canada as well. And when people say, like, are you, do you get upset about it? And, like, this is how I respond. And, like, listen, where I come from, if I go back there, I get hanged. Okay? So yeah. This yeah. is, this is kind of okay. Well, like, I, I grew up with racism in Tanzania as well. Being yeah. fair-skinned uh, amongst the African, they think, because we came there as trades and merchants, they think you have more money. Um, so every time I drove a car, somebody like a police would stop us. And then they're like, Oh, I'm just going to check if you have all of this. They shouldn't be stopping you unless you're driving ill, but I wasn't. And then, you know, they're oh. like, Oh, maybe you don't have your fire extinguisher up to date. And I'm like, okay. Oh. So that's Wait, a rule. So, so, you were, making... you were, you, so you're, you are, you have been discriminated for both being too dark and also for being too <laughs> white. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, so you, you're not, so some people find you too light skin and some people find you too dark. Wow. Okay. Dark. <laughs> so um, anyway. somebody asked about whether or not, uh, yeah, I think it was Musgal, even though you don't want, you have a desire not to go back, would you want a relationship with your family? Your Absolutely, family, yeah. I would. The, re the thing right now is they would like a relationship with me, but I cut them off because I think it's safer for them. Um, I think we both need to take our time and space um, to get to a level where we can accept, and I think distance does it well. So I'm going to give them two or three years to come around. Um, and while I strongly, like, while I help other people feel more comfortable, you know, um, being ex-Muslims or coming out of religion, because in the end, family is not everything. They're also people. Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim-majority countries, advocating for atheists, secularists, and Enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash sjme.